Y'all know nothing about this. You need to pay attention. Sit back and relax. It's time for Good Alls Country Kitchen. We're over in J-Town, off in the cut, over here at Pastime Fish House. I, this is a special review for me. I told y'all in the previous video I was doing a special review with my old favorite student from Eastern High School, Dylan, a.k.a. Vanilla Ice Gallagher, yeah, I know. and his twin sister, Brooke, yeah. who was a standout athlete <laughs> in Eastern also. But anyway, before we get going, I just want to go over a couple things. First and foremost, I always forget to tell you, please subscribe to my channel and hit the like button and comment because that actually helps me and uh, moves up the algorithm. So please do that. Also, speaking of support, Debbie Bowen from Gulf Shores, Alabama, which by the way is my favorite place on earth, spent first nine vacations with my babies there in Gulf Shores with Sam, the National Treasures condo. She also sent me a $25 gift through YouTube, and it's her birthday Monday. Happy so birthday. happy birthday, happy Debbie. Birthday. All right, Bill North continues his strong support for my channel, sent me another $50. Hey, keep and going, stick around for the end of the video because I'm going to give you information on the review I'm hosting on Saturday with the National Treasure. But I'll give you more information on that at the end of the video. All right, Dylan, you got anything oh, you yeah. want to say? I want to shout out Miss Morris. Where's your microphone? <laughs> it's right here. Oh, okay, all right. I want to shout out Miss Morris. That's my favorite teacher of all time. I love you and miss you. And thank, thank you for my, you for my uh, genuine, what was it? The note on my January letter. My, my note on my little January letter. I love you. <laughs> Hi, right. I miss you. <laughs> and Brooke also had Miss Morris for senior English. Yeah, the best teacher. You'll so never yeah, better. You'll never forget Miss Morris, <laughs> no, will you? No. That's my dog forever. But, no, I can right. honestly say, you know, 26 and a half years at Eastern, I have stayed in touch with a few old students from back in the day. But I can say that Dylan's going to be one of those ones yep. that 20, 30 years from now, Lord willing. Uh, we're still in contact <laughs> yeah. if I can live that long. Oh, no, we always going to be in right. contact. But always. anyway, Fish House, known for the, some of the best fish and seafood in Louisville. I was actually here in 2019 in the early days of my channel, but I had an iPhone 5, and the video quality was so poor, <laughs> it was kind of dark in there. You couldn't see anything. <laughs> So I told Tommy, past the owner, I said, I'm coming back one day and I'm going to do this a do-over and give you proper justice. So that's what we're going to do today. Come on in. Let's check it out. Let's do it. <laughs> All right. Before I go in, kind of show you around. They got a nice little patio here, a little beer garden. Nice day. It's perfect to sit out here. And I'm glad I saw the sign just to let y'all know it's cash only, but they do have an ATM. You know, I've always said, if you go to a place that's cash only, you know it's going to be good. See here? Like I said, it's kind of dark in here. That old iPhone 5, it was like you were in a cave before. Anyway, you go up here, place your order up front. We're here right at opening, and they're already lining up in here. But this is a very cool place to watch ball games. We've got a pool table. And it's kid friendly. They even got pinball machines, old Pac-Man, stuff like that. So pretty chill place. Great old time blue collar atmosphere. All right, let me show you my platter. I got a platter with fish, oysters, shrimp. Speaking of shrimp, look at these shrimp. These are real good. I've had these before. Of course, it's got that huge piece of cod that you see there. And I added on a set of frog legs. 
And of course, it comes with fries and a hush puppy and some oysters. Brooke got the fish platter. So, Brooke, go ahead and start in on yours, go if ahead. you will. Go ahead. Look at that big whole loin of cod. Flaky, white. You know that's quality when you see that white flaky. It's super hard fried, too. That's the best fish. So we've right. even let it cool down for a minute, and it's still piping hot. You going to eat any of that tartar sauce, or you just eat it plain? I eat with ketchup. <laughs> oh, I hear you. I hear you. You're like my buddy, National <laughs> Treasure Sam Stallings. He just dips it in ketchup. All right. Nice. We're going to let her get started, get situated. Now a word from my sponsor. Shop secondhand first with Peddler's Mall. New products are added daily by our vendors. Vintage, antiques, uniques, furniture, clothing, collectibles, crafts, gifts, oddities, home decor, and more. Hundreds of vendors in every location. You never know what you will find. Interested in becoming a vendor? Contact us today. 18 locations across Kentucky, Indiana, Ohio, and West Virginia. Open seven days a week. A little light on there from the pinball machines. So dark in here. Anyway, look at that. That's a heck of a platter right there. So I'm going to start with... Look, they gave me... Look at the size of this fish. That gone it. Got that... Look at there. What? That's crazy good, huh? Dip it in some of this homemade tartar sauce. <laughs> Look at that, sir. Comes with that slaw. All right. Look, put that now let me put some of this grace on here. Saved by grace. That, that good all special right there. I'm going to dip it like this. Man, this fish is hot. Man. Look how white that is. Mm. Mm. Thank you. That's it. Sauce again. Look at that. Look at these wings. Look at the wings. We already smashed some of these buffalo wings. The burger just Dylan, came out. Dylan's got him a burger, half pound burger. You know the burger. Uh, Dylan's got the old school first edition Good All Country Kitchen shirt. Bought that for me back when they first came out. Yep. Showing you how loyal the Dylan best. is. After I got hit, I found out who was with me and who was against me. Dylan has always been with me. My dog. All right, go ahead and start in on that burger. He's going to give you the real test. <laughs> Look, that's fat. Half pound. Cheese rolling off. He chose to not get it dressed. No, I like them plain. He didn't want to fix it. <laughs> he just likes it plain. He did a single great white. And if Dylan likes it, then it's good. He did, he did the Captain Quint bite on that. Look. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, yeah. That's a big old thick burger. Oh, and look at these steak fries. Mm, mm hmm. You tried them yet? Y'all tried them? And by the way, for y'all that haven't seen the movie Malibu's Most Wanted. <laughs> Y'all have definitely got to watch that movie to know why I call Dylan Malibu's Most Wanted, a.k.a. White Kong. <laughs> all right. I, I swear, I used to just love sitting there talking to Dylan. I could talk to him all day, just all day. listen to him. All day. All right. So you giving that a thumbs up? 10 out of 10, man. All right. Good, I'll put me on. All right. Somebody just recognized me in here, and I'm glad they came over and talked to me because his son, Kyle, what's your first name again? David. David Whitmer, his son, Kyle Whitmer, is in the hospital right now, 22 years old, going through a, kind of a tough time right now, but was just telling his dad last night how much he loves my show. So, Kyle, I want you to hurry up and get better, and when you come on out of the hospital and get your appetite going, I want you to come do a guest appearance with me. 
All right. So I appreciate you coming over. Thank you very much. All right. So hopefully they've cooled down enough that I can work with them. But Dylan, watch this wing pull here. This is how you eat a wing, right? All right, here. let's see. <laughs> you see, it's V as in victory. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a good tangy sauce. It's got it's got a little heat to it. Believe it or not, I asked them if they had a hot level. They said it was all one level, but that's plenty of heat for the average person. I guarantee you that. Very good wing, a nice sized wing, cooked perfect. They're not breaded, so they are a true buffalo wing. Wings that are breaded, that's not real buffalo style. All right, here y'all, you can have some of those, Brooke. I'm going to go ahead and have these frog legs. This takes me back to my granddaddy. We used to go frog gigging, and my grandpa, L.V. Goodall, we would gig frogs, and he would fry them up. He'd soak them in salt water overnight and then bread them in cornbread the next day and fry them up for dinner. Y'all haven't had frog legs before? It's kind of like chicken. Like a like a dark meat chicken. All right. What you writing, good eye? Wash it down with a Diet Coke. I don't like do the rating like uh, you, eight, is nine, ten. Uh, I will Madison. say this: it's worth the drive here just for the frog legs. Oh, no. for sure. All right, while well, I got you running, I gotta try one of these shrimps. Mm, shrimp. Let's see. It, Look at that. Hold on, let me just hold these up. So let's see them. Hold on. These are big. And the breading I had, I remember before, was really good. Cocktail. Look at all the horseradish in that cocktail. Plus, I'm going to put grace on it. Got to. Mm. Took a triple snapping turtle <laughs> move just to get the whole thing. <laughs> Look at All right, well, now a word from my sponsor. Welcome to Billy Bob's Barbecue and Amish Deli. A little country store with a whole lot to offer, so let's go in and see what they got. They've got homemade Amish jellies, pickles, jams, and honey and sorghum. They've got local Amish-made lunch meats and cheeses. And don't forget the award-winning Kansas City Gourmet Barbecue. Y'all don't know nothing about this Amish liver cheese and homemade sourdough bread. And don't forget about the homemade Amish fried apple pie. Just a 30 minute drive outside Louisville. It's veteran owned and y'all don't know nothing about this Billy Bob's barbecue and Amish deli. All right, Dylan is nerved up. He's not much on the buffalo sauce. What? A flat. Oh, you want to show his technique on the flat? <laughs> What's that? What's the difference? Do you got technique no. where you can do a wing pull? Okay, just stick with the drummy then. Yep. <laughs> oh, look, he's so proper and polite the way he eats that. You don't like it too hot? Oh, hell. <laughs> 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 He's going to be going for the Sprite. <laughs> <It's spicy. laughs> Man, they ain't that spicy. Come on. <laughs> no I'm going to stick to my burger, good dog. <laughs> All, right. All right. Well, I got another item here. All right. I forgot to tell you all about this coleslaw. I don't usually talk much about slaw, but this is exceptionally good. It's the perfect blend 
of mayonnaise, sugar, and vinegar. Perfect ratio. Not too sweet. But all right, my last item is these fried oysters. Look at that. That's not all breading. That's a plump oyster. Comes with at least four oysters. You get four shrimp. But I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to do the oyster and some tartar sauce and grease. Mmm. You would think, I just got back from Daytona, <laughs> you would think I'd be all seafooded out, but here at Pastimes, the quality of everything they have here is so good, it'll make you forget that you just had seafood for 10 days straight. <laughs> all right, we work on this. I think I've tried all my items. Oh, let me get these fries. I actually do some, these look like they got spice coated on them. Yeah, they got a little something on them. Do a little tartar sauce on the fries. I'm winding down. Got this fish with this bread. Made me a little sandwich. Very good. So, before we finish, I want to give you all another one of those wing pull techniques here. Show, show Dylan how it's done again. <laughs> Go ahead. Mm. Jeez. Victory. <laughs> All right. We're going to work on this last little bit. I don't know if we're going to get dessert. But if no dessert, we'll meet y'all outside, give y'all the, the final thoughts, and also the more information on this review I'm going to be doing tomorrow night with National Treasure. Give you more info about that. I'm up here getting a refill. And I saw somebody left this oyster on here. You can call me trifling, whatever you want, but I ain't letting it go to waste. <laughs> All right. So we're going to take a little breather out of here before we go. Because I don't know if I got enough breath to even walk across the parking lot. I'm so full. Mm -hmm. I did get some wings to take home. Those were good. Uh, Dylan, what would you think of your food? Hey, probably... I don't even come to restaurants like that. And I love this place. I, I'm coming back, man. Coming it's chill. Back. I'm coming back. Great food, good atmosphere. It's, right. Hand the mic over to Brooke and let her tell. Yeah, I'll just talk. I think this restaurant was really good. I love the fish, and it's probably the best fish I've ever had. And I highly recommend coming here. All right. Well, all right. I said I'll give you the information. I'm going to say again subscribe, hit the notification bell, like, like button comment section let me know what you think of these videos also ryan's channel if you haven't subscribed and hit notification bell hit that one keep it cool with sheets and also i told you national treasure sam stallings is going to be joining me tomorrow night on a thursday we're going fancy tomorrow we're going to porcini's down in st matthews high-end okay. italian food so I'm really looking forward to that. I don't do fancy reviews very often. We might even be joined by the National Treasure's son, Kirk, who saved my life after I got hit by the bus. That video will be aired on Saturday around 11.30 or noon. So make sure you stay tuned for that and check that out. Anything else you want to add? Thank any you. shout outs to any of uh, your old uh, Eastern peeps? Yeah. Let us be on your channel. All right. Thank Appreciate you all for you being out. with me and not against me. Yes, yeah, sir. And with that, y'all. All right. <laughs> and y'all don't know nothing about this pastimes fish house. Y'all don't know nothing. <laughs> <laughs>
know the facts, but why I'm on a mission, you're always welcome back to Good Off Country Kitchen. <laughs>